since 2002. We have created excellence together. Welcome to Ring of Honor Wrestling. Honor is real. There will never be another Hana Kimura, and today on Ring of Honor Wrestling, we celebrate her life and career. The daughter of Japanese wrestling star mother Kyoko Kimura, Hana's infectious laughter and smile broke language barriers and fueled her meteoric rise in professional wrestling. A champion before turning 20, Kimura will be remembered by many as being a member of Oedo Tai and leading Tokyo Cyber Squad in stardom. By 22, Kimura completed the rare feat of wrestling in both Madison Square Garden and the Tokyo Dome, the first women's match in the Tokyo Dome since 2002. Sadly, Hana passed away on May 23, 2020. On this special episode of Ring of Honor Wrestling, we celebrate Kimura's career by featuring the best of Hana in Ring of Honor. The celebration begins with her ROH debut against Sumi Sakai in Las Vegas. And without any further ado, let's kick things off here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Making her debut in the United States, one of the youngest competitors in the Women of Honor tournament. Yana, this is a woman that you've grown to know very well from your time in stardom. Yeah. How exciting is it that we all get to meet back up here in Women of Honor at Ring of Honor for this tournament. Incredible. Let's take it to Bobby Cruz for our introduction. This is a first round match in the tournament to crown the first Women of Honor champion. It is set for one fall. Introducing first, the accompanied by Kodetsu. Wrestling of Yokohama, Kanagawa, Japan, Hana Kimura. Well, you see the championships on the shoulders of Hana Kimura and Kagetz. Kagetz also in the tournament here to crown the first ever Women of Honor champion. Those are the Goddess of Stardom Tag Team Championships, yes, Diana. Yeah, they are. Both of these competitors are from the group Oedo Tai, so it's going to be really interesting to see the dynamic of both of them out here tonight. And it's incredible because these two petitions could face one another. Yeah. Should Hana be victorious here tonight? Should Kaget defeat Jenny Rose in that great first round match? You're seeing Hana Kimura here. We mentioned one of the youngest competitors in the Women of Honor tournament. Very experienced though, over four years. And, and it's interesting, Diana, she can barely take part in any of the, the festivities, so to speak, here in Las Vegas. All, <laughs> all, you know, all the fun stuff that Colt and I do. But right now, this is tradition for Oedo Tai. So, this very special to Oedo Tai, something Kagetz has brought in from Dragon Gate. It's sort of a traditional dance. Go, there's Oedo Tai. Put him on the strip. Right? <laughs> I got a show, I got a residency for you two ladies. Amazing. Now there is the signal there, but you know what? She's facing somebody 
who also hails from Japan, one of the most accomplished competitors in the Women of Honor Tournament. Someone who's been here since 2002. Let's wait one more time. Two corners, wrestling on the jersey, short Japan, Sumi Sinkai. You ever seen her uh, TV show, Jersey Short? Uh, the Japan? <laughs> jersey Short Japan, indeed. What, what is that? Uh, gym, tan, laundry, and... Uh, and happiness. She's and the hero. The <laughs> happiness. She's the, she's the ray of sunshine here at Women of Honor. As we take a look now, there is the Women of Honor tournament. You see Sumi Sakai, Hana Kamara. The winner goes on to face the winner of Kagetsu and Jenny Rose. And this is just a first round match. Oh, incredible. All the talent here in Women of Honor. You, this could be a finals in any tournament. And we're getting to see it in the very first round. The senior referee, Todd Sinclair. That's how important this match is, Deanna. And you've been in the ring. Sumi Sakai here in Women of Honor action. What does what does Hana have to prepare for, or what should have Hana prepared for? You know what? What's interesting about this matchup is that Sumi has known Hana since Hana was a baby. Sumi trained with and wrestled with Hana's mom for a very long time before Sumi came to America. So, Mama Hana? Yes. <laughs> Kyoko, Kyoko Kimura, who we saw in Philadelphia. Oh, oh some dude. In 2016, and uh, that's maybe she got that like mother like daughter. Can I make? I'll make. Let me make a uh, an observation here. Hana, for being so young, has seen. It seems very poised, very with it, very confident, if you will. Uh, especially her first match in America. Uh, I'm impressed off the bat, and she hasn't even wrestled yet. And, and an interesting note as you take a look at the footwear of Hana. Uh, a kind of a condescending chant of Sumi being started here by Hana. The footwear is traditional jikatapi, excuse me, and that's traditionally worn by samurai. A little, uh, little fun hat at the expense maybe of Todd <laughs> Sinclair. Are you over 50? Would you like to get up to 33% more income in retirement? Then call now for this free book, Annuity Do's and Don'ts for Baby Boomers, from a leading financial firm on maximizing your income in retirement. That's right, free. This free book reveals little known secrets about annuity strategies in simple to understand terms that will help you make the right choices before buying an annuity. And it's free. Call right now for your free book. And as a bonus, we'll also throw in a free annuity rate report. We researched over 1,200 annuities and summarized the rates and benefits of annuities from financially strong insurers. Again, that's annuity do's and don'ts for baby boomers and a free annuity rate report, both absolutely free for calling Annuity General today. Supplies are limited. Call now. Call 800-863-6146. That's 800-863-6146. What a great match this is going to be here. Well, Hana doesn't want the match to start until Sumi flips her hair and... Oh! Delivers the blows right to the face of Sumi Sakai. Of course, this is 16th anniversary here tonight. You can join us for all the great matchups, including our World Championship match between Dalton Castle and Jay Lethal, the tag team title, six-man titles, and of course, the TV title, too. Late-breaking addition to our event here tonight. Oh, come on. And out there, you know, Ian, you're always talking about a manager's license, but, you know, it's very well known in Japan to second your partner or your friend, and that's why Kagetsu is allowed to do this, bring the tradition from Japan here to Ring of Honor. Oh, it's getting away with some stuff I don't is, like. Is that a look, katana? Look at that. Just choking Sumi. Diana, what do you make of this? How do you handle a, a group like Oedo Tai? Well, you know, they've been dominant in Japan. This is what they're known for. I, I don't know. Well, and it's incredible because there is some history with Sumi on Oedo Tai. At one point, it looked like Sumi was in an alliance with Oedo Tai, but she was in Japan recently. Oh, come on. And that's just a pose. That's just a, They're just posing, taking picture opportunities. It's really they're doing a, a favor to the American fans here, seeing them for the first time. Well, we're getting to know them quite well as we head in. The fans filing in. Great day of festivities here for 16th anniversary. You can watch it on pay-per-view cover. Two. On Honor Club and on traditional pay-per-view. And you got to go VIP. I think that's the move. You get all these great events. You get all the ROH on tour events, plus all of our pay-per-view events, like 16th anniversary, Deanna. Just a one-time fee for the same amount that you would pay monthly. That's Honor Club. Look at this. 
Japanese surfboard, Keiketsu. Very much enthused. He loves what Hana is doing right now. Like I said, so young, but so confident, so poised right now. And she is looking great in her American debut. Now, really taking it to a veteran. And, and I mean, Diana, you're also one of the youngest competitors in this tournament. It, I mean, does it, are, are you surprised by the fearlessness right now of Hana? She locks in a half crab. No, you just gotta get in there. You have to be confident in your ability. She's a second generation wrestler. She knows what she's doing and she knows that. And that's the most important thing. And these stardom athletes, correct me if I'm wrong. I mean, right off the bat, they're working them. They're training them. They're constantly going, right? It's wrestling, oh, wrestling, wrestling. Yeah, the hair. 14 year olds in the stardom dojo. So. She started at a baby, you it, know? It's incredible. One of the a graduate of the Stardom Dojo. Look at Kiketz pulling the rope out of the way. I don't know. Those are pretty tight steel ropes there. I don't know how much she's going to get that out of the way, but doing her part as the second to Hana. Hana very much in control. Look at this. Hana, front face lock, looking for a suplex, maybe. Who oh, countered into a DDT by Sumi? She needed something desperately. Maybe this will give her an opportunity. Essentially, it's a two-on-one match right now with Kagetz on the outside, making herself her presence known. Let's see if Sumi can gain some energy back, though. Yeah, finally creating some space, creating an opening has Sumi. Hana gets back to her feet. Nice drop toe hold, sends Hana to the ground. Sumi off the rope, kick, drop kick, right to the rib cage. Kick to the midsection, front face lock from Sumi. Wides up, spins her through. And a snap. Big snap, and look and at the- And a smile. That hooks the leg, two, ooh. <laughs> Mentioned Honor Club, VIP gets you all the great events. For Super Card of Honor coming up, the semifinals of the tournament taking place there. Honor charging wow. in. Big boot drives Sumi right through. Now hooks the leg, cover, two, three, no. So close. I think Hana smells blood here. She's staying on her, but Sumi fighting back big forearm. Look at Hana following her right in, Diana. Into the ropes, countered. Oh, bridge excited, a suplex. Two, two. So close. And we couldn't have. A, a starker contrast of athletes and their personality, their disposition. Women of Honor's Reyes, uh, uh, oh, come on. Todd Sinclair is right there. And I know it's at his discretion, but I don't know if I can agree with this one, Ian. No, I don't, I don't either. And looks like maybe a superplex. Oh, she got it. Starting at the second, almost bringing her to the ground, then driving her down. Maybe finishing it off right here. Look at the strength of Hanakamura! Oh! Cover! One, two, no! Not imagine, Diana, that's hours of squats in the, in the stardom dojo. To have power like that. Yeah, that had to be a good 15 seconds up there. Incredible, and not something you expect out of, out of someone, the stature of Hana. Big back elbow from Sumi, trying to create some space again. And this is, this is outrageous. I this mean, is, can we eject her? This like... is two on one. Oh! Kick sends Kagetz down. Drop kick sends Hana to the apron. And it looks like Sumi has seen an opportunity. She's got a lot of frequent flyer miles, Colt. She a million miler? Sure is. Now's your time, Sumi. Throw her back in and finish this thing off. Since 2002, Sumi Sakai, a staple of women's wrestling and Ring of Honor, competed in the very first women's match. Up to the top. Going to hit our top rope. Jump. Hit she head. got it. Halfway across the ring goes Anna. You've been on the receiving end of that, Diana. I have. It does not feel good. Uh-oh. Look at this. Oh, oh. wait a minute. Hannes scouting that perfectly. Yeah, great defensive strategy there. And then a kind of a dosy -si do with a whirlwind. Charging in. Oh, Whoa! Wow. Nearly took her head off. Yeah, she got all of that. Okay. Her dig cover. One, two. Ooh. 
kick out barely. Anna's got to stay with her game plan here, Deanna. It's, yeah. it's clearly working. She can't get angry. Oh, look oh. at that. Head scissors, rolls her up. Two. Oh, no. <laughs> Giving Sumi an opportunity, though, to get, get a grasp. Look at that move. She's going for it before. Nailed it. Hooks the leg. Two. Sumi advances to the round of eight. Exciting. One, two, Sumi. I like it, Ian. <laughs> To winner of the match, advancing to the quarterfinals of the tournament, Sumi Sakai! And, and it's such a treat to have the athlete from stardom, especially one like Hana Kimura making her United States debut. I have a bed, I have an apple. Oh, <laughs> uh, I got the bed. No, I have a pen, I have a Sumi, then I got that. Uh, so that I have a bed. I have a bed. I got the bed. Look, isn't that Frank Thomas? Oh, the big hurt. More like the big hunk. Yeah. Wow, Frank Thomas. Hi, how's it going? Good. You look like you could still be playing. That's what I said. Well, I am feeling stronger and leaner. So, Frank, what's your secret? I discovered Nugenics. I wish my husband did. It's easy. Just send the text. If you're a guy over 40, text 321321 and enter the word ZIP. You get a complimentary bottle of award-winning Nugenix, the number one selling free testosterone booster at GNC. Nugenix is a unique man-boosting formula powered by Testofen, a patented key ingredient clinically researched to help boost your free testosterone levels, to help you feel stronger, leaner, with more energy and drive, more passion, too. Here, try a bottle, and trust me, she'll like it, too. Text 321321 and enter ZIP to get a complimentary bottle of Nugenics. Samples are not available in stores, so text 321321 and enter ZIP. Best in the World 2018, we get to see some of the big baddies of stardom, Oedo Tai, take on some of the all-stars of Women of Honor. Uh, this, uh, this is one of my favorite matches from that Best in the World show. Like, it had such a interesting mix of characters, personalities, uh, in-ring styles. Like, to see the, the girls of stardom come over and uh, take on some of, our, uh, some of our Women of Honor, like, it, it created for a really interesting and dynamic matchup, and I have nothing but good things to say about it. I remember uh, Hana being very excited and very nervous because this was her USA pay-per-view debut for Ring of Honor, so it was, a, it was a big moment for her, you know? She was so excited, so nervous, but, you know, the, the match turned Turned out great. Everyone in that match like worked their worked their butts off, and it created for such a good moment. And the best part was we got to see the Oedo Tai entrance dance. So if you love uh, wrestling, and you love cool dancing, you'll enjoy this match. This is a Women of Honor, a Women Tag Team match. It is set for one ball. Team number one first, the team of Hazuki. The world of stardom champion, Kagetsu, Pina, Kamura. Together, they are still tied. Way to tie, of course, this is the first time we're ever seeing the world of stardom champion compete in a Ring of Honor ring. It was just last year that we saw Chris Wolf, the then high speed champion. And now we're seeing the great dance of Oedo Tai. Brought over from Dragon Gate to start him. All this traveling already. Ooh, Jenny Rose connects now. Big clothesline. But I have to say this, Ian. Fisher wants to. Although she is great, it's, she's still only 20 years old, could be the weak link in this match. That's the clothesline. And she's not even the youngest on her team, Colt. I think she saw the game plan go over and knock everybody down, do some bruising. Oh, great tag team continuity. Ooh. Kagetsu and Hazuki. Hana Kamura now in, delivering forearms to the back. Great tag team Kamura and Kagetsu were. Tanil one step ahead, makes the tag into Mayu Iwatani. She up was top. ready, wasn't she? Ready to go at all times. Super split leg drop kick. Oh, but look at this. Hazuki, who will challenge Sumi. Championship gets taken out by Jenny Rosa in the spear. Butterflies the arms. Gets her. 
Double underhook suplex, Mayu Iwatani! Got her! Cover one, two! Oh, so close. Just in the nick of time, folks. And what a showing on the ladies' <laughs> first ever pay-per-view live experience. And the champions have taken each other out to the outside. Mayu, full head of steam. Oh, oh no. Got her with that placard made out of wood. Big, big kick there. Pump kick By there. Hazuki. Pump kick rocked her into the clutch now. Front face lock from Hazuki. Everybody paired off on the outside. Hana, looking for a brain buster. Ooh -hoo. She's got it locked in. She sure does. Look at this. She needs to get that upper arm off from around, but it's in pretty deep right now. Submission. Body scissors. Mayu. Looking to make Hana cover a tap. And unable to remove that arm, and she's still going to be oh, able. Oh, look at the strength. To muscle her up. Look at the power of young Hana Kamura. Got her. Hook the leg. One, two. No. Queen in the middle of the ring. Able to kick out. Could it be? The Golden Retrievers here at UMBC. Oh, here it comes. Looking for that bridging dragon suplex. Misses with a kick. Mayu back to her feet. Drives it right through. Hana. Could it be? Dragon suplex. There's the bridge. Oh, Number oh, one, oh. two, three. Mayu Iwatani picks up the victory for her team. Who wins in the match? It's Iwa Mayu Iwatani. Jimmy Rose. Tineo Dashwood. And the women of other champion, Sumi Saka. Are you over 50? Would you like to get up to 33% more income in retirement? Then call now for this free book, Annuity Do's and Don'ts for Baby Boomers, from a leading financial firm on maximizing your income in retirement. That's right, free. This free book reveals little known secrets about annuity strategies in simple to understand terms that will help you make the right choices before buying an annuity. And it's free. Call right now for your free book. And as a bonus, we'll also throw in a free annuity rate report. We researched over 1,200 annuities and summarized the rates and benefits of annuities from financially strong insurers. Again, that's annuity do's and don'ts for baby boomers and a free annuity rate report, both absolutely free for calling Annuity General today. Supplies are limited. Call now. Call 800-863-6146. That's 800-863-6146. I met Hana a few years ago. I actually worked with her mother, Kyoko Kimura, in Ring of Honor, and I always remember hearing her talk about, and everyone else for that matter, about Kyoko's beautiful daughter, Hana. When I finally had the opportunity to meet Hana, holy moly did her smile bright up the room. And anybody can tell you that her aura and just her bubbliness and her, she's just so happy. In 2017, I lived in Japan for almost three months. I was working with Stardom at the time and wrestling in their Grand Prix tournament. Whether it was training or on a bus for six hours back and forth to Osaka or many other places, I was always with Hana. She was just always smiley and giggly and bubbly and just a burst of energy. from Stardom, one of the most accomplished teams, Kagetsu, the world of Stardom champion, teaming with Hana Kimura, former goddess of Stardom tag team champions, against the woman they call the icon of Stardom, and one of our great stars who you know very well, yes. Jenny Rose. Exactly. I cannot wait for this. Oh, are you kidding me? Thank you. Wait, 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 wait a minute. minute. Cool. How come you don't wear anything like that, Ian? Uh, I was wondering where you're going to pet me. Anyway, let's take it to Bobby Cruz for our introduction. <laughs> This is a Women of Honor tag team match. It is set for one fall. Keep number one, 
are representing Oedo Tai, the team of Hana, Kimura, and Kagetsu. Hana, Kimura, and Kagetsu, of course, very accomplished goddess of stardom, tag team champion, dominating the tag team division in stardom for quite a long period of time, almost a year. And there you see Hana up front in the kimono, the World of Stardom champion. That Stardom top championship could get to. They're accompanied by Hazuki, who had a great effort last week against Sumi Sakai, but ultimately came up just short for that Women of Honor championship. And Mandy, I, I gotta ask while you're here, we haven't seen you in quite a bit. Is, is, oh, is she wanted to be pet by me. Well, I can you know, only assume that's it, right? I haven't been around, and I gotta say, after the Women's Championship tournament, I was really upset, and I wasn't happy with the outcome. So I just didn't want to wrestle here. But you know what? I'm here now, and I'm scouting the competition, and it's looking really good, and you never know when I'm going to strike next. Well, first, we will see a star from, from my hometown, my home region, the great state of Pennsylvania. Take it to Bobby Cruz. Third opponents first, rest got to fill it up here, Pennsylvania, Jenny Rose. Jenny Rose, the first number one contender for the Women of Honor Championship. Looking to get back on track. We I saw a great effort from her and that eight woman tag at best in the world. One of the women she teamed with there is her partner, who we'll see right now. Her partner wrestling at Amine Yamaguchi Japan, Mayu. She, of course, has held the World of Stardom Championship. She's currently one half of the Goddess of Stardom Tag Team Champions. And right now, she was so impressed with Jenny Rose coming over to Japan to compete in the Women of Honor Tournament, to compete in stardom. She handpicked her partner, Jenny Rose, Mandy. She should be impressed. I mean, Jenny Rose has competed in Japan over the years numerous times. She can keep up with these girls. Absolutely. No problem. She's competed in stardom, seedling Diana. And it was in Diana, actually, that she faced Hana Kimura's yes. mother. Diana? No, Diana. Oh, Diana. One of the great promotions there. And she competed against her mother there, who we've seen in Ring of Honor in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. But right now, we're going to take a look at the two teams that will compete here tonight. Charging in, shoulder tackle. And these two had such an intense match in Osaka. Of course, Jenny volunteering to travel to Japan to take on the best in the world. A quick tag. We're seeing some great continuity so far from Jenny and Mayu. Ooh, look at that. Somersault Senton. Cover one, two. Oh, just a one. Like you said, great in and out tagging. That's what you need to do in tag team wrestling. Keeping Kagetsu one of the very best in the world. You got to put her right up there with Sumi Sakai, the Women of Honor champion. Jenny. Look how we see all that honor. Oh, man. Really, you know, Kagetsu called the shots there. Colt, Hana in great position to stop Jenny in her tracks. But Mayu sends oh. Kagetsu full head of steam to the outside. A way to tie with the advantage. Fans, we're gonna take a quick commercial break. Stay with us. Are you over 50? Would you like to get up to 33% more income in retirement? Then call now for this free book, Annuity Do's and Don'ts for Baby Boomers, from a leading financial firm on maximizing your income in retirement. That's right, free. This free book reveals little-known secrets about annuity strategies in simple-to-understand terms that will help you make the right choices before buying an annuity. And it's free. Call right now for your free book. And as a bonus, we'll also throw in a free annuity rate report. We researched over 1,200 annuities and summarized the rates and benefits of annuities from financially strong insurers. Again, that's annuity do's and don'ts for baby boomers and a free annuity rate report, both absolutely free, for calling Annuity General today. Supplies are limited. Call now. Call 800-863-6146. That's 800-863-6146. Fans, we are back. Women of Honor Tag Team Action. Eva Gabani, Cole Cabana, and Mandy Leon. 
Nakamura driving the knee into the chest. And there's nothing Mayu can do about this. She's try she tried to get in, but Tonsa Claire. Oh, Jenny Rose. Jenny Rose nice. taking care of business here, though. There we go. And you see Mayu desperate for a tag. Jenny's so close. There Makes we go. A tag. And the icon of stardom, Mayu Iwatani. Coming in hot. Pump drop kick for Hata. One for Kagetsu. Irish whip reversed. Now Mayu into the corner. Hana nobody home. Look at this great roll through. Rolls her She's up. not done. Ooh, almost a shining wizard, but didn't get enough of it. Maybe didn't even get all of it. Yeah, Hana did a great way of swiping her away. Crisscross. Ooh, It'll fancy. make you jump, jump. Crisscross applesauce. Beautiful. Great wrist lock takeover. Using the leverage of both women against them. She's not done though, Ian. Man. Oh, two for one special on a way to tie. Payback. Mayu fired up in Fairfax. Oh, oh wow. wow. Almost may have broken her neck there. Drags her in cover. One, two. Nice kick out from Hana. What's the push out? Aiming the game, though, is getting those shoulders up off the mat. You still got to think this match is almost two on one because Jenny's still in trouble on the outside, still trying to recover. It's almost three on one, Ian. Yeah. Oh, nobody. Oh, what a frog splash attempt from Mayu. Uh oh. Running interference is Kagetsu. Oh, ho, ho. driving oh, in this modifier to put submission. Wow. But Jenny coming in full head of steam, able to break it up. And that was in dirty, too. Certainly was. You got to think that would have been the end of the match here in Virginia. Back up. Front face lock. Ooh, gets out of it as Mayu. Spinning thrust kick. Connects to the temple. Off the rope she goes. Caught. Hanakamura. Delivers! Great suplex slam! Both. Both. They need to make a tag. Yeah, both. both ladies are down, desperate for a tag. I mean, two of the fresher women on the outside. It looks like maybe at the same time. Yeah, daylight opening, and now it's Jenny Rose and Kagetsu who faced each other in oh, Women of Honor before. What, what is this? Going for those eyes, very, very Kagetsu-like. Off the rope she goes. Caught. Sidewalk slam from Jenny Rose. Twisted, still twisted. Front face lock, great snap suplex. Beautiful. Fisher Woman's two. Whoa! Oh, man, that was so close. And what would that have meant Come on, for Jenny, Jenny Rose. Rose? Pinning the world of stardom champion, Mandy. Unbelievable, so close. It would have been incredible, it would have vaulted her career. Jenny Rose going to the top now. Sure is. So many things Jenny can do. Perched up top. Jenny, big clothesline, sets Kagetsu down. That's cover. gotta be it. Two! Wow. And that was a great cover, you're right, Mandy. All of her body weight across the legs. Jenny trying to get the crowd back involved as Mayu has Hana on the outside. Trying to bring Kagetsu back to her feet. Delivering the forearms. Down to one knee is Kagetsu. Oh! Ooh. And rolls her through. Oh, no. Cross arm breaker. That's Look at in this. pretty good. It's in pretty deep. That arm almost hyperextended. Look at Hana keeping Hana's Mayu keeping out of Mayu it. away. There is no way don't for her tap, to go. Don't Jenny, don't tap. Trying to get to the ropes. Jenny, nowhere to go. She's so close. so close that she gets to the ropes. Scooching her way towards the ropes. And you got to think that some heavy damage has been done there, Ian. Absolutely. And now Kagetsu looking for that firewoman's carry. So many things she can do as Jenny fighting for her life. Forearm from Kagetsu. Return volley from Jenny Rose. Jenny Rose saying, bring it. Some great fighting spirit right here in the middle of the ring. It's great Trading. Joshi action. Trading forearms. Firing up as Kagetsu. As Jenny and that firewoman's again, but Jenny, knowing the danger, fights out of it. Rush kick to the midsection, could get to full head of steam. That's the clothesline. Oh. Whoa! Spins her inside out. Jenny Rose cover. One, two. two. Oh, oh, just a two man. count. Just a 
the two count. Hana getting just enough. Kagetsu finding just enough to kick out. Mayu Yutani came in like at the perfect time there. Almost, I think they were exactly on the same page as tag team partners. Hana on the outside. Kagetsu fighting out. Oh, God. oh and you know when Kagetsu grabs the rap. You know they have a game plan. Oh, that wooden, that wooden symbol. Jenny Rose is out. But saw kick. Cover two. Unbelievable. Wow. Oh, the bridge out. Bridging out of it. You're right, Colt. That's fighting spirit, but what are they going to do here? Oh. Double team. Oh. Oh, Todd Sinclair is being taken away right now. Cover two. Picking it up. Now Mayu dumped to the outside. Kagetsu, here we go. Connects with that fireman's carry. Falconow, two, three. What a match. The winners of the match, the team of Kagetsu and Hana Kubara. Well, what a great Women of Honor tag team match we just saw here. Colt, Mandy, we take a look at the replay. A great display from Oedo Tai. They are the victors. Take nothing away from Jenny Rose, who continues to impress like she did at best in the world. ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっ
big plank by Kagetsu Kevin. These are dangerous women, and they do it often with a smile on their face. That's the, uh, boy, oh boy. When your worst adversary can look at you in the eye and smile and give you that devilish grin right before they put you away. But they have captivated the world of professional wrestling, and they're here in the hallowed halls of Madison Square Garden. There you see Jenny Rose posing for the great international contingent of photographers documenting this historic event. It's Kagetsu on the left with the Red World of Stardom Championship. Hazuki you see there with the Black Leather High Speed Championship. As fans are filing in before we get ready to kick things off officially for G1 Supercar, a great event. With New Japan Pro Wrestling Ring of Honor, Stardom, Rev Pro. It is already a happening. And we're so glad that you chose to join us here in Madison Square Garden, a historic event. And what a way to kick things off as we get ready to take a look at the traditional dance of Oedo Tai. Taught by Colts Cabana. Thank you. That's the original boom boom right there. Hey, I was working on that move myself earlier today. You were working for months, and then they just went out here and did it, Kevin. They, they scooped you. Dang it. Well, here's the woman that I'm proud of. I've, I've been looking forward to calling her match. Her match at Madison Square Garden. Over 20-year veteran coming to the Big Apple. Oh, look at that. Does that say, I'll be back? And that's, that's Takahashi's here. That's Sumi Sakai, international legend. Oh, wait a minute. I want to get a good look at this, Ian. I'm not so sure. Whoa. Introducing team number two, the team of Stella Gray, Hanakumura, and Sumi Sakai. Kevin, did you think that was Takahashi? Well, yeah, and she definitely is wearing the gear of Hiromu Takahashi, and even the handwriting on that sign. I think that was written by Hiromu himself. Well, we know how desperately he wanted to be here. He's been sending out tweets. He said he's at 5,000%, I believe it last week said. But there's Sumi Sakai, who's always been so great, who's helped bridge that relationship with Japanese talent, whether it's New Japan or stardom. And she's going to be doing some bridging here tonight. Her new protege, Stella Gray, making her Madison Square Garden debut, as is Sumi and Hana. They'll be teaming with a woman who, through the draft process of stardom, has now gone from Oedo Tai to sort of a freelance group in Hanakamura. So it's going to be two interesting trios facing off here tonight in Madison Square Garden. There you see the time bomb shirt. Referee Paul Turner drawing the assignment. Oh, Jenny Rose. Well, right to Sumi. They're kind of ha a half-hearted handshake there, code of honor. And I have to wonder, will Jenny Rose be on the same page as the way to tie? And right now she is. And this is the service with the smile. This is this disgusting behavior that they do, laughing and smiling. But when you got the gold, you can have that kind of fun, Kevin. Yeah, but again, they're smiling, so it's all good, right? Ooh, that's not good. Stella Gray. Less than two years in, Colt, we've seen her grow in, in Women of Honor. Unbelievable to be in Madison Square Garden two years in a professional wrestling, right? Oh, look at that. It's been 20 for me. I couldn't even get a match. Face breaker and now Kagetsu and Hazuki in with Sumi Sakai, the inaugural Women of Honor World Champion. Double drop to a home. And the tandem offense of Oedo Tai. Coming into play here, they certainly have the advantage. And the quick tag to Jenny Rose. Kevin, you got to like the instant chemistry so far. Yeah, and again, when uh, and Jenny felt uh, a little passed over and perhaps carrying some of that grudge with her, uh, I'm sure she got very quick on the Oedo, Oedo Thai playbook. And Jenny has Sumi. Oh, ooh, sidewalk slam, hooks the leg. Two and ooh, two and a half. Nobody's gonna quick tag. Oh, yes. Notice how quickly she tagged out, realized you weren't going to get the win. Let somebody else get a victory. As long as the team can get it done. And away to tie. Look at that. Just disrespectful paint brushes. And it's Suzuki. Oh, man.
This is not the way Sumi Sakai wanted her Garden debut to go. After leaving it all behind in 1999, a 20-plus year career making her debut, and she's fighting back with these huge shots. Wow. And it's Hazuki nobody home. Front face lock, Sumi, TJ Neckbreaker. Needs to make a tag here now, Cole. Yeah, you see the desperation again. Sumi's not going to get a, a pinfall at any time soon. Hana Kimura, quite the contrast on the way she looked when she was in Oedo Taino. Very colorful, this bright spirit. Hana Kimura taking off the head of Hazuki. Did you notice how Hana was kind of calling the shots too, telling Stella oh, to take down the other team? Cover two and just a two and a half there. Wow, she comes flying with those huge boots. How about that hair color? Ooh. And one of the youngest competitors in women of her history is Hana Kamura, as is Suzuki, Suzuki, excuse me, and Stella Gray making the most of her Madison Square Garden debut. Kevin, do you understand that now? Yes, of course I do. Saying it's over, front face lock, looking for a brain buster. Will she get it? No, counter. Instead, has the guillotine choke in, but I can't tell who has the advantage here. Hana with the choke of her own. Yeah, it, it looks like she's got to move Hana's left arm possibly over and away from her neck. As Hazuki. Both women grappling for position. The strength of Hana. And Hana brings Suzuki up and down with a big vertical suplex. Hooks the leg. Two. And oh, just the two count. And Kevin, this is Colt and I's first time in the garden together. You've been here many times. Can, can you speak to the nerves of being in this building with this electricity that's going on? Everybody's feeling it today, no doubt about it. And now these, well, everything looked good. Then it looked bad, and now it's looking good. We might have a submission here. Oh, the tide has turned indeed. Hana Kimura really the, the impetus of change there, the catalyst. And Ian, you're talking about everyone has nerves. Well, if they all have nerves, it's kind of an even slate. Got to think about it that way. And Hana will be thinking about that huge pump kick from Hazuki. And in a very competitive situation like this, it really comes down to calming those nerves. And that's where the veteran presence of Sumi could really come into play. Calling Jenny out of this spear. Spear connects, cover, two, and ooh, just the two count. I've been so impressed right now by Jenny. And this is really the first time now we're going to see the world of stardom champion Kagetsu with an opportunity here to do some damage on the former Women of Honor world First time champion. they've had a little bobble with the teamwork, but now they're right back on the same page. Oh, oh no! Oh. Like a teeter-totter, Sumi connects with a double DDT. Double spike DDT. And Brain Buster connects. Hooking the leg. Two and, ooh, just a two count. That was really close. Notice the way Kagetsu threw her off with a lot of authority. Still some energy in the tank. Maybe a little bit of bad blood. Hana wants to get her some from the world of stardom champion. <coughs> Sumi. Smash mouth delivers. Hey, now you're an all-star. Hooks the leg. One, two. Oh, Jenny just in the nick of time. Hana did all she could to try to hold the troops off, but the number is just too great. And a kind of a breakdown here. Oh, it's going outside. And Sumi, we know she loves to fly. And they all fall down. But she got her own team. A way to tie out of the way. <laughs> Hopefully it's a sacrifice that's worth it. Oh, Spear drops Sumi again. Hazuki, Kagetsu, full head of steam. Wow. Stereotope Suicidas, and it's not looking good for Sumi Sakai. Yeah, notice the no hesitation right back in the ring. Wow. She got her with all of that. Two. Oh, it's Sumi kicked out. Variation of Kelly Klein's finishing move, wondering if she's sending a message. Up again, again, second time. Catches the clothesline. Smash mouth, maybe. Hazuki springboard. Oh! Shotgun drop kick. Jenny. Wow, Sambo suplex, judo throw. Sending Sumi down. World of stardom champion, Kagetsu. 
The team of Jenny Rose, Hazuki, and Tugetsu. What a win. And you gotta think, that victory has international implications. The world of stardom champion has been the inaugural Women of Honor World Champion, Kevin. Hello, everyone. Today, Madison Square Garden. It's a very traditional event. 会場で試合でした。試合は。一緒に。タコくんのすみさんが。負けてしまったんですけど、こんな機会は。なかなか。ないっていうのは。分かってたので、存分に。アピールできたんじゃないかなと思います。また。日本に帰って、試合をするのが楽しみです。バイバイ。I first met Hannah when, on my first tour of Japan, she was in my very first match. It was me against Oeda Tai. And within a week, I was drafted into Oeda Tai. So we were teammates for my first tour. Uh, she was fantastic, so welcoming. She helped me get used to Japan. Her English was the best out of everyone there. So she loved to test her English with everyone. She told me she learned her English through rap songs and American movies. So she always had very strange sayings that I don't know if she even knew what they meant. Her energy was unparalleled. She was such a bright person to have at training and at shows. Um, she always took extra time to come over and talk to the Gaijans and try her English out and learn as much as she could. She will be so missed. She had turned into such a superstar over the years that I know her and her energy and everything will never ever be forgotten. Japan will never be the same and we will hold her in our hearts for the rest of our lives. Being good to each other, being kind, being positive can go a long way and hopefully uh, within you know, 2020, 2021, the years in the future, like we can all just try to be a little bit more kinder and positive to each other and it would definitely make the world a lot better place. Something to take away from this that just can't be said enough is to just be kind. Be kind and realize that words do hurt and let's make sure something like this never happens again. Let's be kind to others. Take care, everybody. I, you know, hope you uh, are all staying safe and take care and be good to each other. <laughs>